The woods are lovely, dark and deep, but I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep, and miles to go before I sleep. I think of Robert Frost's words in winter, especially if I can feel and taste a heavy snowfall in a dark understory. At a crossroads of thought, they remind me of the wonder of life as light fades and my own hourglass empties. Like an ellipsis at the end of a phrase, the words call me to larger thoughts. Oh, the things I've seen this year. Life in its abundance with new discoveries and new understanding. It's a blessing to live in a large and colorful world where goodness exists in spite of surrounding chaos and confusion. Where out in the wind you can breathe clean air, clear your head, and think for yourself without distraction. Up on a ridge on my land I placed a simple homemade spear where I often meet the maker. The spearhead points to the vast depths of space, but when I bow my knee and grasp the spear's shaft, I can feel the heartbeat of the great God who made it all. And I know he feels my pulse as well. So I come with cares, with thanksgiving. Petitions, yes, but also praise to the only one truly worthy. He promised life everlasting to those who believe and follow, and I do. I don't know the miles still to go before I sleep, but I'll keep my own promises till then to share with others the great gift once wrapped in a Bethlehem manger when Jesus Christ was born to take our sins to the cross. And he cast them far as east is from the west to whosoever believes. We've probably never met you and I. If you follow my work, I'm happy. But especially at this blessed season, I want you to know where I stand beyond my daily treks with a camera. And I wish you joy at Christmas with the hope that you walk on the narrow way. I'm Mike Blair in the Kansas Outdoors.